That one was four, just over four and a half minutes. Yeah, yeah. With the um, with the 4S, the 1300s, because that's an 1800, with the 1300s, if I push it, uh, about three and a half minutes. I got a couple of fuel skies. Mm -hmm. The old day reckons. He said, majority of the time, 70 75% is a, is a good storage rate. I think Dave's telling me, mm -hmm. don't let the battery go down into single figures. Mm -hmm. have, you got, have, you got a, have you got a power meter? Yeah, yeah, I've got my. Um, what do you got? I've got that to my that's tester. Him, that's yeah. So don't let them, don't Try let them, my flights, yeah. Don't let them get it, just put it on, just make sure you don't get down the seat. Yeah. Seat. I, always, I always land it basically at, um, at storage charge at around about 50%. But Anywhere between 20 and 10 is, is alright. Mm. When, when you come down and land, which you should have left. Yeah. If you go in the single feet, it's just knocking the battery around. So that's what he reckons. Yeah. Anyway. Well, I mean, for this particular aircraft, I fly it for speed once i get below about 50 percent on the battery it sags i can tell it's not going as fast really yeah okay yeah okay yep so i'm just like yeah. i landed anyway but i know like i've got my wristwatch here i'll set the timer and i'll have a glance at it every now and then and um you got a timer on the, on the not on that just my watch oh, yeah, so i'm as i'm flying that's why i have it facing this way so i don't have to do that so i'm flying and i can just glance at it well, this is this for here. I've got one of those uh, timers that you get. Well, egg timer or whatever. Yeah. That's fine. Yeah, it? absolutely. Well, All right, take it easy. Right. See you, Tom. in this wind too mind you here we go wow i'm gonna uh, have a look around and see what happened that was crazy so that was something 51 seconds in i'd say that blew up the impeller that was kind of cool shit but cool that's going to end it for today but let's check out the damage yep nothing much left blew a bunch of fan blades off fan blades came off it. There we go. No fan blades. So I'm thinking I'm going to probably need another EDF unit. Hmm. Alright, let's go and find all the bits. I'm sure there's some blades over here somewhere. I swear I was here, launched, went up. It was around here somewhere. Gotta be around here. I think it should be just in here. 
little bit there. Bottom. Not much. Thankfully this thing comes with a couple of screws. Take the bottom out. I can just uh, put in a new fan. Don't need a new motor. Just need a new fan. ESC is good, motor is good, so that's going to be pretty cheap to fix. And that's why boys and girls, if you buy the smaller stuff it's cheaper, and as a result, when you blow it up, you can replace it fairly cheaply as well. So right now though, this is the end. I still have like two batteries to go. Kind of sucks. Would have liked to have flown it. But, it's bound to happen. Glad it happened out here while no one else was around. So. We met Tom today, that was fun. What else have we done? Flying around, enjoyed the wind. It's kind of crappy weather. And blew some blades off an EDF. What a day. All right guys, take care and I'll see you in the next video. Bye. Oh.